the Mons population is a little over 2 million, swelled recently by uh, refugees from Iraq and uh, earlier than that from Palestine. Um, but uh, about uh, two thirds of the population, or I'm sorry, about one third of the population, or some would even argue uh, more, uh, live here in Amman. Uh, it is on an elevated plateau, about 3,000 feet, so it does get the breezes. That's not quite as hot. Here we are on the Transjordanian Plateau, overlooking the city of Amman. Amman uh, has a distinct rainy season in the winter wet Mediterranean biome because it's an elevation at 3,000 feet to uh, get some orographic lifting and it gets about 15 inches of rainfall a year, most of it in the winter time. You can see the houses are built uh, whitewashed in order to uh, reduce the heat. Wait, okay. Right there. Okay, this site uh, dates to uh, about 8,500 BC when the Ammons, when the Ammonite culture settled here. Because it was well watered and protected and uh, strategic in between uh, uh, trade routes, taken over by the Greeks and the Romans and then the Persians and the Babylonians. But uh, now there's still a city here, the largest in, uh, in uh, Jordan, about 2.5 million people are. Roman amphitheater, probably dating what, from the second century, I think? But uh, quite big, actually. It was a very important city. It'd be way cool to see a concert here or a play. Looks like that's what they're getting ready for. Problem is, you can hear all the horns and everything from the background. But here we are in Amman, home of the Ammonites up on top here. The town was uh, briefly named uh, Philadelphia. And the walls up there on top are the walls of Philadelphia. I wonder if there's a cigarette butt station in the second century. In the back alleys, way hidden away, you can buy booze. Oh, here are my clothes being dried on top of my Amman Hotel. About 6.30. Sun getting ready to set. Like everywhere, uh, the higher up you go, the wealthier it gets. So far, I've only gone down the hill and into the uh, market area. And uh, it's just not as wealthy as the top of the hills. <laughs> 